And out that way, next stop, Japan. Long swim. Good morning everybody and welcome back to the channel. Um, it's a gorgeous September day here. So I decided might as well go for a ride. And why ride alone if you can bring your mom and her little dog with you? Absolutely. Right? So I think we are going to do the uh, Port Renfrew loop today. So I think the plan is to scoot straight down to Victoria and then start out and uh, start the loop and then I don't know what we're going to do. There's a few beaches to see and who knows what we'll find along the way. So hope you enjoy the ride. that way. Um, we can do gas station coffee out by Harley. It's the only one there. I wonder if that uh, beat. Timmy isn't there. Oh, there's a Timmy Hills there. Okay, we'll go there. so we made it uh, just outside Victoria um, it's sort of the beginning of the loop we head through Souk and then we go that way uh, you can go through Duncan we're gonna end up in Duncan though so uh, yeah so we're just doing a quick uh, coffee stop caffeine up maybe go for a pee giving Rosie a little chance to get out she seems to be enjoying the sidecar for her first ride um, everything's gone well so far not too many people tried to kill us on the uh, Malahat there, so that's always good news. Just a couple goobers, but I mean, what do you do? It's like one of the worst stretches of highway on the island, I feel. I hate it. And uh, if I'm gonna get a speeding ticket anywhere, it's gonna be there. Ask my son. Like, he never lets me forget when I got a speeding ticket in mom's truck, so. Anyways, we're gonna do up these coffees and then just uh, get back on the road. quick stop off here at uh, Souk Potholes Park just up off of uh, Souk River Road as you can see this is the Souk River and they have the potholes here so um, it's about a 450 hectare park Galloping Goose goes through it and they have what they call potholes so they're really deep swimming holes all the way up the river where the fish come to spawn and and uh, really nice places to swim hike and uh, like I say, the Galloping Goose trails are here. So kind of a neat spot. Never been here before. I thought we'd check it out. And it's quite nice. I didn't bring my swimsuit, but it's warm enough to go in the water. I bet you it's cold though.
right, so we set them on French Beach for lunch. Um, it was more a choice out of convenience. Uh, the traffic got really, really heavy. There was a whole bunch of construction going on. We were gonna stop in Renfrew for lunch, but uh, we got hungry. <laughs> it's like two o'clock, so. Yeah, so we're just gonna eat some lunch, check out the beach a little bit, and then continue on. don't know how the audio is going to be so I apologize if you can't hear me but pretty neat spot fishing charters there's some neat uh, there's the uh, what do you call that? there's the pub back there at the Port Renfrew Hotel where you can grab a bite and a beer we already had a picnic so we're not going to do that good spot to stretch your legs and just check out
sound. Your battery power kind of died on the GoPros part way there on the way home. So I'm back home now. Uh, I guess I left the house around 10 o'clock this morning and it is now quarter to seven. So it's definitely a full day trip. Um, lots of beaches, parks to check out. Um, if you're into protesting, there's protests you can go hang out at. Um, yeah, just something for everybody on that ride, for sure. It's probably my favorite ride on Vancouver Island um, and the best twisty roads you can find on here. It was just, just awesome. So thanks a lot for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed the ride. Um, if you like this video, please put that thumbs up button. And uh, if you want to see this pretty face some more, subscribe and uh, you'll get notifications for when there's new videos and content. And keep the riverside down.